to your boy is back to give you guys an update on the new travel restrictions because I know y'all want to know what's going on on the island, what's shuffling and what's jiving. So I'm going to give y'all the new updates that are going to be in place from February 8th, day before my brother's birthday, a hey, shout out Cam, to March 14th, right before the Isles of March. Shout out to Isles of March to all my people who know about that Shaker Spear, Macbeth. Yeah, we culture. Y'all ain't even know. Y'all ain't even know. Shake a spear in love. <laughs> Repeat after me. Hit the subscribe button. Like, comment, share. Yeah, what was that? Hit the subscribe button. Like, comment, share. Yeah. Thank you, though. It's really going a long way. We're getting closer to 1,000, y'all. Now, let's get on the swerve. So I know what y'all wondering, what do I need to what do I need to get to Puerto Rico, man? I need my passport, do I need a test? Do I need if I don't have a test, they're gonna kick me out. What's gonna happen? Ah! Cool out, shorty. <laughs> All you need to do is buy your ticket. You don't even need a passport, man. It's easy. Bring your ID. When you get on the plane or when you land at the airport, you're gonna have to fill out a declaration form. On that online declaration form, you are basically announcing that, that either you got a negative test within the last 72 hours or that you're gonna quarantine yourself for 14 days in some type of location. Those are your two options. When you do that, they're gonna give you a QR code. You hold it up to your phone, turn the brightness up. Yeah, make sure you turn the brightness up. They be bugging. So boom, you landed, you did your, your declaration form, you go get your bag, you're ready to hit the door. It's gonna be a man standing there in an all white jumpsuit and a mask. Don't be concerned, it's for his protection, not yours, it's safe. He's gonna take your QR score. Remember when I told you to turn up the brightness? Mm-hmm, this is that moment. He's gonna turn up your brightness, he's gonna scan you, get on your merry way, and now you're ready to have fun in the sun, in the sun, under the sun. So after that, what are the updates? What's the rules that we actually care about, yo? So far, so good. They moved curfew back an hour, so now you can get your thing on until midnight. Boom, I'll take it, you'll take it, they gonna take it. For businesses, they stay open until 11 now, so they also got that extra hour. Boom, uh, beaches, marinas, natural reserves, all them little rivers, they are open as well, and you just cannot have alcohol out there. So once again, if you remember the last video, which I'm gonna link, you already know, remember the instructions. I'm gonna get you a little thermal, pour your alcohol in there, they ain't gonna bother you. Safe, safe and sound. Nothing to worry about. No I pro, lemma papa. Next, public facilities and public locations, all that type of stuff, gyms, casinos, museums, if you're trying to learn something. I wish you learned something. Um, pools, where you up in there with all these nasty COVID water. Those are gonna be limited to 50%, 50%, those are now open to 50%. So we moving up in the world, you know, to the deluxe apartments. Restaurants will still be 30% inside. So boom, that's what you got. Bars, bars and discotecas, party clubs, whatever, they're still closed. I did find this funny, however, in lieu of what's been going on the last few weeks and month, they have shut down Old San Juan at night from midnight to 5 a.m. And you can only come in if you're a resident or you are a tourist staying in that area because down in La Perla, shout out my other, other video, I told y'all about La Perla. They've been partying down there and having a good time and I plead the fifth. So yeah, they kind of ruined the fun. You know, if you were there, it was a moment you would have had the chance. If you didn't, you didn't, but we'll see. It'll be back at a glance. Mm, bars. So yeah, the mall, and I don't remember if I said it or not, the gyms will also be 50%. So you can still go get your shop on. If you forgot to get your socks or your wife beaters, any of that, you can still go ahead and get that. There's uh, all the pharmacies and stuff. They got their regular curfew hours they've been having, that, which are following these rules. Um, an unfortunate one is the ferry to Culebra and Vieques. Those are still residents only right now, so you can't just hop on the ferry. But remember, in my other other video, that there are water taxis and, cat and boat services that can take you over there. And I still have been seeing people on Instagram looking so beautiful going over there. So it, it's happening. I'm, I might, I might, I might, I might take y'all on a trip in a little bit. Just, just wait on it. Wait on it. Breathe easy. 
Now looking at it, that's all that's really new for real, for real. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing new popping off, cracking off, sliding off. I don't even know, ducking off. Um, that's the rules, that's how it is. I'm back in PR, I'm happy to be here. I got my spirits is up. This sun look nice. I might show you, I might not show you the sun. But um, yeah, we got new flame content coming out. As always, make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe. Do it more. We're getting closer and closer to a thousand. And aren't y'all along for the journey? Don't y'all want to see me get to the goal? Not a, just a thousand, that's the first goal. Then we go into our second goal and the triple goals. Difficult takes a day, impossible takes a week. I, I do this in my sleep. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I got some new content coming. I want to try a couple new things. I'm going to do a, a nice little video where I show you guys kind of some of the recommend to you guys some good restaurants and places, the other little places to go that I haven't already. So you know what to do when you actually get here. Uh, second, I want to do some of those walking tours, walking through the city so you guys can not just hear me tell you about the street, but you can hear the streets. You can feel the streets, you know? You know, a brother like me, love the streets. Be feeling like one of them ball plays. <laughs> Shout out to Peyton Four, man. Top five movies ever. If you don't know about it, you ain't, if you ain't know, you lost. Go look at it and get found, shorty. Best top five movies, but it's not number one but it's up there. Nonetheless, yeah, I'm thinking about adding those type of videos, give y'all walking tour, let y'all hear and feel the street so y'all can really see what's happening, whether that's a lot or a little bit. Uh, you know, as usual, it's gonna be more adventures, more rivers, more natural scenery in the greenery, huh? And yeah, also, what would y'all like to see? What do y'all wanna know about PR? Give me some recommendations. What y'all wanna hear, what y'all wanna see, what y'all wanna do, wanna be balling, shot calling, I wanna know. And yeah, let me know. We be on it until the next one, next update, next video. Who knows? Something could happen. It's a three-day weekend. Mm, 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 mm. I'll see y'all there. Y'all be easy, be loved, be blessed. I don't even know. Thanks, subscribe. Yeah.